Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to my channel. Alright, so this game right here was really a seesaw battle that went on for like almost 17 minutes. And I'm not going to make you sit here and watch this for 17 minutes. So I sped it up. Sped it up. Look at that. Spit it up. Spit it up. Spit it up. Look at that guy. Take that. Anyway, uh, this was a pretty good match. That's the one thing about these uh, capture the flag games, man. Sometimes you can rack up a lot of points because, uh, well, you just get two teams that are evenly matched and it just goes back and forth. Um, but what I want to talk about is what are you guys going to do this summer? What are you guys going to do this summer? Over here where I'm at in the summertime, I usually uh, don't game as much because um, I'll, you know. I'm doing some vacation time, I'm doing, I go out into the wilderness, and a fish, I'm camping, in a real tent, testing myself amongst the elements, uh, I believe it's good to do that every once in a while, once a year, you know, that way you get to appreciate all the things that you have when you are completely without them. And some people are like, that's crazy, man, I appreciate everything I have, I appreciate it all, my man. Hey, listen, maybe you do. Uh, but for me, I like to go out there, test my skills, see if I still know how to make fire, still if I can fish. Cause when, you not, when you go out into the, in the wilderness and you don't have any food, what do you eat? Bark? No, I don't think so. You're going to be shitting splinters, pal. You don't want to do that. Painful experience. I'm not saying I'm ever traveling. I don't want to. But, uh,. Look at this, I'm strapped right here, they just busted out a SR-71. Anyway, yeah, but that's usually what I do. Travel, camp, go fishing, get out in the sun, you know, maybe read a few books, learn something new. That's what you should do this summer. Go do something different, you know, maybe learn something new. Um, but on top of that, maybe it's on the other side of the world. Maybe you're watching this and you're on the other side of the world. Maybe it's wintertime where you're at. What are you guys, what are you gonna do for winter? What do you have like a tradition? Uh, maybe like you go build snowmen like eight feet high. I don't know. Maybe you do those sort of things. Maybe you have a special recipe that you always cook for every every uh, every winter. Maybe a special soup, special cookies. I don't know. I'm just asking. Maybe you go camping in the snow. I don't know. Maybe you go ice fishing. I don't know. But just don't eat bark. Alright? Don't do that. Yeah, so I'm going to go to uh, Lake Tahoe this year. I always go to Lake Tahoe. Well, not always. Sometimes I go to Lake Tahoe. Do a little bit of gambling. Do a little bit of... Uh, get a little drink. A little get my drink on. Get my drink on. My drink and drink. Get some purple drink. Some purple drink. But yeah, I do some camping. I go up to uh, Bernie Falls, beautiful spot up in Northern California. It's in the land of volcanoes. Check this out. Boom, boom, boom. All right, so now we're back to normal speed. Look at that. I passed right past that guy. He should have killed me. Apparently, he wanted to die. At this point, the game's tied up. Oh, we're about to tie it up right here with this. Gotta get in there. Turn this corner. I'm like, oh man, they're all over me. Get this guy. I remember my teammates like, come on man, score it. But I knew there was a guy behind me. He gets that guy and another guy. I didn't want to run over there because they were only going to get me. So took my time, patiently waited, got the flag cap. And there it is, all tied up, 1-1. One, one. This was a super long game. But that's alright, that's alright. Calling that napalm. Drop some fire on that ass! It's always a good time. I like getting people with napalm. One thing with napalm, man, if you ever see it and you don't know whose it is, don't test it. Just don't test it. And there's always those people who want to test it. And they end up getting burnt. And then I get smashed by this chopper. 
I don't have at this point. I don't have a uh, anti-air class, so I'm just kind of being mindful of the chopper. I'm just trying to get my ass zapped. Look at this, still trying to get me. So I gotta stay inside. I'm on the spot where I can actually go run out and try to take it down. So I'm just waiting. I see my teammate over here. He's creeping up on the flag. I try to cover him with a grenade. Boom. Get that idiot up there. And then I hear, oh, teammate is down. Teammate's down. Drop the flag. Boom. Get this guy. Alright, here we go. Here we go. We're off to the races. We're off to the races. Gotta bring it back. Gotta bring it back. Here we go. Let's end this game. Get this guy. Cut him off guard. Get his, oh, I'm stunned. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna make it. Ah, so close. But teammate comes through. Clutch in the end. Gets the cap. 37, 25. Two caps, three returns. Did all right. Like I said, it was a long game, so it was a lot of killing, a lot of dying on both sides. Good time. So, yeah, let me know what you're going to do. What you going to do this summer? Later.